Hello again, everyone. This week, we are moving on into the back half of chapter four. We're going to be focusing on more of the technical side here, more of the mechanical stuff we can do with these logarithms and exponentials. In 4.3, we're going to be looking at some of those more advanced things that we can do with logarithms stuff like our product and quotient rules, our exponent rule, and things with changing bases. So I mentioned that a couple times, we're finally going to be able to see that. Then in 4.4, we're going to look at how we can use all of these types of things, all these types of strategies to solve exponential and logarithmic equations, where basically everything we're going to do here relies on the one-to-one -one property of exponents and logarithms. If we've got a logarithm, we're going to throw in an exponent to get rid of it. If we've got an exponent, we're going to throw in a logarithm to get rid of it, rearrange, and get some answers that probably aren't going to look very nice, but will at least be actual numbers. And then finally, we're going to tie all this stuff off by looking at the big sets of applications for these things in terms of exponential growth and decay and data modeling, the way that we can represent things from the real world in terms of exponentials, as well as a thing called logistic growth and other applications we have therein. Where for this week, we've got our worksheet, we've got our practice problems here with some of these algebraic properties. Really, more than anything else in here, we need practice, and we're going to get lots and lots of practice. And then, because we're finishing up chapter four, next week, we have our due dates closing up for my lab. So particularly at those quizzes due then, and like the last minute extensions, all those sorts of things. Think about that for next Wednesday. And our pre-assessment for next week, going on in to make sure we're as prepared as we're going to be able to get for our exam. Anyway, that's what we've got all going on in here. Let's get in there, get some work in there, and finish off this chapter.